Hello again. Slightly blowy, slightly dull, but I can't complain. Still got my shorts and shirt on, so it's not all bad. So no real big plans today. Just heading off to the polished set direction. Short walk. Um, got a doctor's checkup, diabetic thingy this afternoon, so I want to get back and get ready for that. So I'm not going off on a mission today. And otherwise, all good. Plus it's going to rain around 12 apparently, so they say, and they're not normally far off. So I'm out a little bit earlier to make sure I don't get caught in the rain for a change. <laughs> Still standing. Library. And all the names of books and authors written on the wall. Hard to make out now, of course, because they were done years ago. There we go, Timmouth Library. Sign's still there. Good old Sheldon. Having some sort of 1875 day today where they all dress up in old fashioned costumes. That'll be every Wednesday throughout the summer. So I'll try and get over there at some point. Would have done it today if I didn't have the assisted doctor's appointment this afternoon. But it's all good. Sheldon's not going anywhere and the videos aren't going anywhere either, so we're bound to mesh up at some point. Train. Oh, winter rose, safe and sound, lovely. Wonder if there's any seabirds for me to scare away today. No, oh, none at all. Not going to feign. Too much surprise, of course. Train! Caught that one. Whee! Oh. Well, that's pretty much poly steps I think for today. All present and correct. Nothing untoward going on. Nice and peaceful. All good. Let's head off towards the fish key. I'm actually going to do some of my walking up and down. It's not too windy on this bit. And I'm going to get my steps in because it's curry night. Lovely. Look forward to that later on. Smash in.
Right, well I've done the walking up and down thing now for just over half an hour. So, I'm gonna head over to the fish key, but we just get this train, if we can. Onwards to the fish key, at last. Now we eventually make it to the fish key, almost on cue, this starts to spit with rain. What a surprise. What a surprise. Slightly different style of boat today. This is a different one, obviously, with the wood interior. And it's called Templar. Lovely. And the good news is that the jetty isn't blocked off today, so I'll be able to get over there, get some shots of the back beach in a minute. No pilot boat in the mooring today. And no ships in dock. Notice the fares lit up in the distance. We'll have to check that out in a minute. Now I've been asked by Rob in the comments if I could do a little then and now about this place, which is Six the Strand Timmouth. And that used to be the Lifeboat Inn. It replaced the Foresters Inn, custom built in the 1870s. So it's been here for a while. Here's a picture of it when it was in full swing as a pub. I've also got a beer mat that I can show you as well. Here you go. And no doubt when it was the pub, it got a lot of its business from what was the Morgan Giles shipyard, which is where the Leander Court flats now are just up there. But we've done the Morgan Giles a few times in other videos. But if you just search Morgan, the top result will show you exactly how it used to be. LJ to Beach Shack and the tail end of the ferry. I didn't go down to where the ferry docks today because just as I arrived there it started to rain and I needed the toilet. When I came out of the toilet um, it just sort of stopped raining so I'm going up to the point. Hello mate, where's the chips? A relatively quiet point today. The lower pathway, impassable on foot again.
wind blocker off to try and catch as much ambience of the fair as I can. What I love about the fair, you hear different songs coming from different areas, different, you know, all playing at the same time. And of course your favourite song attracts you to the ride that's playing your favourite song. be attracted to me if I was a bit younger. The cage, I used to go on that as a kid. Spins round, goes up in the air. No one on it at the moment. Yeah, there's no one on it, they must be giving it a test run. Waltzers aren't going yet, but hopefully that gives you a taste of some of the noise of the fair. Lovely. There we go. I hope I wasn't too much of an assault on the senses. I enjoyed that though. A little wander through the fairground. Like I say, enjoy the idea of different songs coming from different directions. At, you know, all at the same time. And if you all like that one, you sort of turn towards it, and that's the ride you're attracted to because they're playing the song that you like. It's cool. I don't know if you can see it, but it is starting to rain now. A little bit more than just a light spit. I've got my hat on and I'm going to start heading home. So we're going to come down here in about just under an hour's time. Like I say, go to the doctors, have my diabetic yearly checkup. Going to get great results this time, especially with my, my teeth situation. Where I've been eating loads and loads of rubbish, but it's an anomaly. It's just a one off. Once I've got my teeth, I'll get back to normal. Three meals a day, healthy eating, lovely. All good. Finn McCall's Fish and Chip Shop. Just about to open. And we'll cut down the street with no name. Yeah, I'm not making that up. Look, there we are. The street with no name. Just go through here. And we end up French Street. That'll be for the carnival. All right, there we go, call it a day. So I've got to go down again, get wet, uh, see the doctor, but I'm sure it'll be okay anyway. I'll update you tomorrow. All good. Thanks for watching.
Take care. See you again tomorrow. Bye.